they said they have direct access to access. Guys, we're 84 at this all hinged uh, transit. Uh, they special call logistics here for the rail carts. They have uh, electric rail carts, like the Nolan rail carts. That's the uh, logistics too, that's the spare. They have a small condition. Uh, I believe it's a uh, electrical vault or something in the tunnel of the subway. Five seven Alpha to command. Go ahead, five seven. All right, I came out of that uh, original ventilation shaft, and it's right around the back of the unit. All right, ten four. What is the ladder going up to that? Uh, it's, uh, yes. Yeah. Alright, They have a precautionary line stretched to the emergency exit here. Uh, 276 is, uh, doing the communications. The purple K will reach from here. 57 Rescue Battalion. Alright, out of the main tunnel. Alright guys, as you Man can see, they got smoke condition. 5-7. Who is down in the tunnel right now? Uh, to where you are at the hatch. I also have 279 going back down into the emergency exit. He says he, he, he put the antenna up uh, in the tunnel. He'll have another form of communication. So that's what we're doing right now. Can you tell me who you have down in the tunnel? All right, I made it to the end of the tunnel. I had a uh, rescue two. Squad one, everybody else is still in the tunnel. How many members we have down there? I assume that, that room we're talking about is right at the base of that hatch you're talking about, correct? Damn four, I got four. All right, you have four members plus yourself, correct? Rescue battalion's down there, I'm at the top of the hatch. All right, can you call the rescue battalion and find out exactly who he's got down there? All right, he has three members, we're going to rotate them up because they're low on there. I believe those are the uh, Kudo radios or the batteries. Man post 229. Pump will pick up a hydrant someplace right where your rig is and stretch a uh, proportionary fog line. Responding 1788, we're gonna have to stop. 
All right, guys, here are the rebreather masks. Uh, I have a video coming soon about the uh, rebreather masks here. They have them set up and uh, they're ready to go. There's a total of 36 on the truck here. Um, and they carry, they have a piece of ice that's inside that uh, they put the ice inside the pack and it gives them cool air. Uh, four hour work time or three hour work time, one hour escape time. Uh, specially trained members are uh, trained to use these uh, packs here. Uh, rescue squad hazmat and selected engines and ladders and battalions. At this time, guys, they are waiting uh, Purple K to arrive with extinguishers. I'm unsure if they're going to use the physical Purple K unit, but it does have extinguishers on it. If you have your aid, go to the command channel and give us a radio check. On we were about channel. four hours in on this incident. Therefore. Yeah, feel calm with the communication radios. Those are the new ones, new CUDA radios. They replaced them. The yellow is the uh, communication line. Hey guys, so it's a power substation transformer blue down there. Show 
for the 279 show. Can you just move your rig? Bring a pass. 10 4.
Hey Lou, you guys good? Still five seven. Rescue battalion to the five seven. Five seven. Yeah, all visible fire has been extinguished. We just uh, got a little hot spot. And four, five seven in command. Go ahead, five seven. All right, from the rescue battalion, all fires out. They just hit a few hot spots on the unit. And four. See they stretch the line down in there. They have it secured to the fence for the carabiner. fire knocked down uh, so they're gonna put the rebreather the mask back they do have uh, purple K 33 coming in the closest purple K at this time very busy uh, with a lot of collapses going on uh, from the uh, storm tropical storm last night uh, numerous collapses rescue one going all the way out to Queens but uh, they still got purple K coming in for a precaution Alright guys, these still got communication uh, batteries and radios coming in to uh, this side of the uh, incident. Thank you. 
time to uh, do a final wash down and get all the equipment. Only two companies have been here for uh, almost four and a half hours. Ed, as soon as safety says the tunnel's clear, companies can take up. And uh, 229 is washing down, the rescue of the is down there, everybody else is out. I'm holding 103 over here. Alright, then we'll just hold till we got, let me know when we're done. Hey guys, just a progress report. Uh, they're still venting out the tunnel, they got the fans, uh, the subway fans going. And uh, we're waiting for the rail car to come out. They uh, have uh, equipment that they're moving around to this side, I believe. 550 That was down by the incident. He is bringing it up for you. And four, that was one of the tools I sent him down for. Thank you. All right, ten four, chief. All right, guys, they're bringing up the Nolan rail card. Thank you. 
This is how they uh, take this cart and put it on the back of an engine. Um, there are certain engine companies that have these, and then the Logistics has an electric one, uh, the Rebreda has one, Squads, I believe, have them. All right, guys, well, that's how it's uh, set up on there and put on there. We're going to be going 10-8. There's another 1075 all the way down to Bay Ridge. At this time, not going to happen. Seemed like they got it though. It uh, was just uh, kitchen extension to con um, con uh, cabinets.